December. Okay, so I said I was gonna go in order. I said for the next three months, we started in November, ending in January, I was going to open a new package with you guys, the dossier. So dossier, as you guys know, is a up and coming perfume company made in France, um, risk free to order, vegan, cruelty free, and super clean ingredients. If you have sensitive skin, so far I can attest that this perfume does not irritate your skin if you are either hypoallergenic um, or if you use a lot of hypoallergenic things, sorry, or if you have allergies or you're super sensitive to just smells in general. These smells are very light and crisp and they are very, what's the word? Fragrant. I need at least one word blurb every single video, but they're very fragrant. They last for a super long time. Um, and it always comes with a sampler. So just in case you don't like the scent, you don't have to use the actual bottle. You can just use a tester. And if you don't like it, you can return it with no hassle. So, okay. I said to you guys that I was going to try a new scent and unbox it for you guys, which I already looked at it. I already opened it. I can already smell it. So technically this is not really a full unboxing, but we're gonna do it anyways. I haven't sprayed it. So using the tester. Oh, you guys wanna see the bottle. Of course you wanna see the bottle. What I really like about their packaging is it's super clean. It's always sleek, like you, it would go with any room aesthetic. If you're the type of person that just likes to have your perfumes kind of on display, I feel like you can't go wrong with this packaging in any room. But I'm gonna use the tester. And put on this. Mm. This one's really good. It's minty. And the scent for this one is ambery mint. And the top notes are mint, green apple, lemon. The middle notes are geranium, cedarwood, and vetiver. I'm so sorry if I said this wrong. I'm sorry I'm not also looking at the camera. I should be looking over there, but anyways. The base notes are vanilla, amber, and tonka bean. And I said in the last video that I'm super sensitive to vanilla scents. I don't really like vanilla scents because I feel like they're too sweet and it makes me feel a little sick. But this is just the right amount of vanilla. It's not sickly sweet. It's very minty. It's very clean and crisp. And I will recommend. I give this scent out of five stars. I like this the most. I like this better than the last scent from last month. But this one, I will give this a five, actually. Let's see if January can also be a five. They do always have specials going on, but you can, you guys, just for you guys. Exclusive, this is exclusive. Just for you guys, you guys can get 10% off using my code, Juliana O, and Juliana O10. I'll have the coupon here, like I normally do. My little cheap graphics. I'm trying to <laughs> But anyways, you guys can use my coupon code for 10% off of course, but they do have specials going on due to the holidays. And I can't imagine any other better gift to get yourself or someone that you love, but a scent. Now, on to the video. Okay, as you guys know from the title, this is a Pink's Edition lingerie haul. So the first one I picked was this pretty light blue lace with a velvet kind of texture to the bottoms and the top. Um, I picked it because I'm not really too keen on bras, but these bralettes were terribly cute. I just could not bypass it. Then going to the next one, um, again, it was like a crushed velvet for the bottom, and then the top was lace, and I even took a selfie in it. <laughs> I really liked it. But, um... Yeah, so the top again was a bralette, and I can use it as the top, really, honestly, which is what I would normally do. So the next two is totally picked based on comfort. Um, what you're trying to look at right now is the cheek, the cheeky underwear, which again, nothing really too special. I just needed some really simple, really basic, comfortable pair of underwear. 
Last but not least, something I really love is this cheeky pajama set. Um, again, it was from the 2020 winter collection, but this one was very comfortable. I'm very surprised that it's not also see-through. You could bypass it and wear it out. Oh, I do. But I would just would wear kind of like safety shorts underneath it because it's a little bit too short. Happy December, guys. I know, I know. It seems like, well, it is. I'm only putting out videos once a month. But um, like I said earlier in the last video, there's still a lot going on, a lot of changes, a lot of shifts. But I will try to get on a regular schedule back over again in February, which February would be my one year anniversary on YouTube. Um, but guys, hopefully you guys like this video. Hopefully you guys subscribe, share, um, ask a bunch of questions. Go ahead, ask me anything. If you guys want to see something in particular, I'll try my best to get it done. If there's a brand that you guys want me to go and try out, let me know in the comment section. Thank you guys so much for all your support. Bye. Quack.